Hello and welcome to a warm, sunny Saturday afternoon in northern Italy. We are at Monza, the temple of speed for rounds five and six of the 2020 TCR Europe season this weekend. And once again, it's Mark James in the commentary box for this Saturday race. Moments away then from round five of the 2020 TCR Europe season. Green flag waves. Watch Mehdi Binani on the right of your screen. The revs rise, the lights go on. They go out and we are racing a good start, I think, from Dan Lloyd. I came from the mud. There's dirt on my hands. Strong like a tree. There's roots where I stand. Try to catch me howling at the moon. I'm Daniel Lloyd, I race for Brutal Fish Racing Team. Uh, very, very wet conditions in our session. Uh, we have uh, three hours until free practice two. Hopefully it will dry out, but things are looking good so far. It's gonna be dry tomorrow and Sunday, so um, small preparations, maybe if it rains later in the year, but all good so far. Hi, my name is Martin Riba. We are racing in our beautiful Brutal Fish Racing Team. Uh, we had a practice session uh, in the morning which was very wet and very rainy, so not really good and we hope uh, to get a better weather in uh, FP2 and for also for the race tomorrow. We came in and we put it back to 5.1 and it, it was much better. He did a 57.4. Huh? Too much out. Totally different. And he, he was getting speed on the You go to, you turn late, very late, and you hardly even touch the red thing, not even the. No, because. And then you are Because I have the car lost. If I touch the curb, I will. I, will, I, will, oh. I, I don't trust the car to go into oh. the you know? Because I feel like the car is already like non stable. Yeah, that's that. You follow me in. I, I got that quite nice. And you did it really yeah, good yeah, that yeah. one. Yes. Yeah. But you could have told me a little bit more. I, mean, uh, I, I, I didn't fully understand what was going on. I, I thought I thought you wanted me to slow down, so then you could do another lap behind me in the full tall. So I did the best I could. <laughs> My name is Trevoriola, racing for Brutal Fish. We are here in Milan, Monza, in the Temple of Speed, and yesterday the practice were a bit strange because in the first one we had a lot of rain, so in the second one we had to do everything at the same time, which, uh, which is uh, stressful. But, but yeah, we're happy and confident for the qualifying. Let's see if we can manage to, to be in the top five and fight for, for some podium for, for the race one. Because All the way me, for in. example, my my goal is to do the second lap, the yeah, fastest yeah, one, yeah. the first no, one. So I, I will I'm take. You for two laps. I will take control distance because I will try to catch. So in the lap, in the second lap, at the end, I still have the yeah, the yeah. toe in, in the. Front yeah. end. Then we go pit in and we all go out. Together. The only thing, unless if we're like really up on a third lap, then we finish a lap. Same with you. If you're really up on your third lap, just finish, finish it. it. Yeah. yeah, because we do have the time. Okay. And then we pit, do the tires, whatever we want to do, and then you swap, and I just follow you. Yeah. Okay. Q2.
Good. We just finished qualifying, I managed to get P2, a really good result, very happy with that and um, big improvement from yesterday, we were down in P16 and the team changed the car a lot overnight and all the hard work paid off. We were just 300 soft pole which was a shame but really really good position for the race. Um, another 3 tenths to P3 so I think we really showed our strength today and a uh, big thank you for the team to change the car in such a positive way overnight. They were working late last night, so big thank you. The qualifying went uh, pretty well. Uh, Daniel and I, we are in the top five, so it means that we can fight for podiums in both races. And I just hope to have a clean race, uh, score, score some points for the team. And I made a good job here, uh, the whole team, so we can leave the Italy with the lead of the championship by teams. Welcome to a warm, sunny Saturday afternoon in Northern Italy. We are at Monza, the temple of speed for rounds five and six of the 2020 TCR Europe season this weekend. And once again, it's Mark James in the commentary box for this Saturday race. So, moments away then from round five of the 2020 TCR Europe season. Green flag waves. Watch Mehdi Binani on the right of your screen. The revs rise, the lights go on. They go out and we are racing a good start, I think, from Dan Lloyd. This drag down to the first chicane, which usually causes issues here at Monza. And Dan Lloyd indeed, I think, has got the line. Dan Lloyd is nosed in front of Mehdi Benani, and it's Lloyd who leads through the first chicane. having opened up a lead of nearly six tenths over Dan Lloyd as the battle for third still goes on, there's contact. So not uh, the best race for me, good race for Daniel, Daniel managed to be P2 and not good race for Pepe as well, Pepe made it to P3 and then he got uh, smashed out uh, in, the, in the first chicane and I managed uh, to have a great start to make it from P16 uh, already on the first lap on, on to P10 and then I was really hardly hit behind, from behind by this uh, uh, Audi driver Tufik and he, he hit me in uh, Parabolica and the race was basically over for me. I joined, I managed to restart the car after like uh, 40 seconds and, and I joined at the, at the last position and finished 16th. But uh, yeah, too many contacts and uh, they should really do something about the driver's behavior in the, in the championship. So tomorrow we have a new race. I hope we will be uh, more lucky, me and Pepe. I, I hope we will uh, avoid any contacts from the other drivers that have uh, really, really damaged our, our race today. And I hope that uh, Daniel is now leading the whole championship by, I think, about 18 to 20 points. That uh, he is starting for P10, for, from P9, that he will be able to score points to maintain the lead in the championship. But you were going. I, I was so afraid not, not that we don't hit because you were going like sideways. No, no, but the thing that happened. And Benani came right out of Ascari when he was out, he came right in front of me. What? I lost two and a half seconds. I saw he, he went just up right in, in, in he wiggled, and went straight on. Right. And then uh, but he, he went twice. But he was out also in Ascari too. Yeah. 
in the uh, same lap. Clarin. Both Clarins have picked out like really, seven yeah. drivers in one race. Yeah. Both the two brothers, like seven drivers into, out. Into where he went off, I had a really big moment, but I just kept it on and then I looked in my mirror and them two yeah, did the same. So yesterday we had a mega result with a P2. I got into the lead on the first lap and uh, couldn't hold on all the way, but fantastic for points. We extended our championship lead, so perfect weekend so far. Today is just about scoring points. It's the reverse grid, starting ninth on the grid today. So it's going to be it's going to be tough, but we have good good pace. Uh, so let's see what we can do. We need to bring the car home nice and safe and the more points the better so any any uh, any higher up than sixth is a big bonus today so let's uh, big push race one uh, was a little bit mess uh, i was fighting for, for the podium and when i got into third position the, i got a little hit from from a competitor and it broke my rear tire so i had to retire I could not keep going the, in the race and now for race two I start six uh, I will try to finish uh, what yesterday started because it looks like uh, I can be on the podium and finally get a, a good result and also get points for the team which is the, the main goal of the, for me right now okay so it's another day it's Sunday uh, we didn't have much luck I didn't have much luck yesterday I hope it's gonna be better for me and Pepe also today race two and uh, let's bring some more points to Welcome to another gorgeous autumn afternoon here in Northern Italy. Hello everyone, it's Mark James in the commentary box here in Monza, the Temple of Speed, the third oldest purpose-built racing circuit in the world for this weekend's two rounds of the 2020 TCR Europe season. If you were with us yesterday, you'd have seen, I think it's fair to say, probably the most incident-packed race of the year so far. So we're waiting for the green flag. About 30 seconds or so earlier than we were predicting, but we are almost underway. The marshal waves the flag, the radio messages will be getting through, and so we are waiting for the lights that go on and off. We are racing, watch Brichet. And indeed, it is Dan Lloyd who outdrags Brichet. Dan Lloyd comes around the Peugeot, makes a better start. A really bad year but finally uh, I'm back and I, I showed uh, that I haven't forgot how to drive. <laughs> 